Hello everyone and thank you for joining this technical analysis video here at Xem.com. It's Tuesday, October 6th. I'm Christina Barthenigo, investment analyst, taking a look at the euro versus the Japanese yen in the daily chart. So having a look at the chart, we can see that the euro yen had confirmed a bearish uh, head and shoulder pattern two weeks ago after crossing below the 124.40 neckline. But uh, following Monday's rally, which closed marginally above that threshold, it seems that uh, the pair is retesting the trend reversal formation and it remains to be seen if it can gain additional strength in the coming days, eliminating hopes of a downtrending market. However, if we look at the momentum indicators, uh, the RSI is uh, barely above its 50 neutral mark. The stochastics are moving sideways around their 80 overbought mark, while the MACD continues to recover within the uh, negative area and above its red signal line. So we don't have a clear bullish uh, signal for the short term, and that makes downside price movements possible in the short term, especially if the price slips back below the 20-day uh, moving average, where we also have the 23.6% Fibonacci of May's rally around 124. In this case, uh, the area between 123 and uh, the 38.2% Fibonacci of 122.23 will come back into focus, while below that, the next stop could be somewhere between the 200-day uh, moving average and the 50% Fibonacci of 120.75. Otherwise, if uh, the market manages to surpass the 50-day uh, moving average, which acted as strong resistance on Monday, it could uh, rest near the 125.60 restrictive region before heading for the key 126.40 barrier. Uh, beyond that, we would uh, resume hopes that May's uptrend is not over and may continue towards the 129 number if the 127.06 peak is breached as well. So that's all for you again today. Thank you for watching and have a great day.